We now know for the first time that these objects can drop 80,000 feet within a matter of a few seconds. Our aircraft can't do that. Famed physicist Michio Kaku believes we've just received a message from the stars, and it's one NASA desperately tried to keep under wraps. An interstellar object, designated 3I Atlas, is hurtling through our solar system, but this is no ordinary comet. It recently emitted an unusual energy pulse, a signal so strange that it defies easy explanation. While official channels went quiet, citing mundane reasons, the data tells a different story. We're going to reveal the truth about this mysterious visitor, the bizarre signal it sent, and why it has some of the world's top scientists questioning everything we know. First Contact or Cosmic Coincidence Back in July, astronomers initially spotted it as merely a faint glimmer of light, barely distinguishable from the millions of other pinpricks in the cosmic background. You see, finding something like this is like spotting a single specific grain of sand on a mile-long beach at night. Yet today, what stands before our powerful telescopes has morphed into something truly remarkable and, for some, deeply unsettling. We're essentially watching a real-time demonstration of cometary mechanics, electromagnetic plasma interactions, and honestly, a profound test of humanity's ability to observe and understand without jumping to conclusions. What many overlooked is its speed and trajectory. Currently positioned less than two astronomical units from our sun, that's about 186 million miles, this wanderer barrels forward at approximately 134,000 miles per hour, and its momentum is still building. During its tightest swing past the sun, scheduled between the 29th and 31st of October, its velocity will peak near an astonishing 152,000 miles per hour. Try to wrap your head around that. A body of rock and ice ejected from some foreign solar system millions of years ago is now plummeting straight into the fierce radiation zone encircling our sun at a speed that could cross the United States in under two minutes. The next several days represent an absolutely crucial observation period because at these speeds and temperatures, anything can happen. The story got even more interesting on October 3rd. This date marked the moment when 3I Atlas skimmed closest to the red planet, approaching within about one quarter of an Earth-Sun distance from Mars. This specific alignment, a pure cosmic coincidence, created exceptionally favorable conditions for every single robotic probe currently circling Mars to gather unprecedented data. It's a stroke of cosmic good fortune. Right when our home planet's telescopes start losing visibility due to the intense glare from the sun, Mars steps forward, offering a premium front row seat to the show. And it was from this vantage point that the first hints of something strange, a pulse of energy, were reportedly detected before the data stream went eerily quiet. The evidence is mounting that this is more than just a simple comet. Why Mars holds the key? Europe's space agency, ESA, has two robotic scouts ready and waiting. The first is Mars Express, a seasoned orbiter that's been studying the planet for years. Alongside it is the ExoMars Trace Gas Orbiter, designed to sniff out faint chemical signatures in the Martian atmosphere. Both are now pointed away from Mars and toward the interstellar visitor, prepared to collect photographic evidence and what scientists call chemical fingerprint analysis. Meanwhile, America's orbital sentinels are also on high alert. The Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter carries a spectacular instrument called the High-Rise Camera, powerful enough to spot an object the size of a dinner table from 200 miles up. Then there's the MAVEN Atmospheric Monitor, which also has sensors that can be repurposed to study the comet. Both of these probes enjoy similarly excellent positioning to get a clear look. But here's where things get suspicious. The thing nobody tells you is that right when these American probes were in the perfect position to capture the most detailed data, certain information pipelines went mysteriously quiet. The official reason given was a temporary federal funding freeze in the United States, a bureaucratic hiccup that conveniently coincided with a once-in-a-lifetime cosmic event. To many, including insiders who spoke off the record, this excuse seems a little too convenient. This is where the theory of a hidden pulse comes from. The claim is that an unexpected and powerful energy reading was detected and a decision was made to classify the data until it could be understood. Thankfully, science is a global effort. 
The Chinese and Emirati missions, Tianwen-1 and HOPE respectively, might contribute valuable confirmation data if their mission controllers can swivel their sensor arrays fast enough to catch a glimpse. Scientific certainty demands this kind of parallel observation from different sources. It's the only way to separate wild guesswork from genuine, game-changing discovery. So what are these instruments actually looking for? It begins with brightness measurements. 3i Atlas has already climbed toward magnitude 12 on the brightness scale. While it's still invisible to the naked eye, it's perfectly visible through high-quality backyard telescopes. What's far more fascinating and a huge red flag for scientists is how its brightness spike veered away from all mathematical projections starting around mid-September. This was the exact moment the object penetrated the two astronomical unit threshold from the sun. In simple terms, it's glowing much, much more intensely than our best science predicted it should. Now, some of this anomaly could be explained by simple measurement variables, but not all of it. The dramatic and sudden increase in brightness is what first tipped off Michio Kaku and others that this was no ordinary dirty snowball. Something happened out there, and the silent orbiters around Mars may hold the only proof. Evidence of a cover-up. On October 2nd, we got a bombshell piece of evidence from the most unlikely of sources, the Perseverance rover on the surface of Mars. During a series of nighttime imaging sessions designed to photograph the Martian sky, the rover's cameras captured something extraordinary. Spanning roughly nine minutes with stacked exposures, the images showed a narrow diagonal streak slicing through the vertical star trails created by the planet's rotation. This wasn't a glitch. This streak remained visible across multiple consecutive frames, displaying a distinct elongation pattern that perfectly matches the motion of a rapid interplanetary object. You see, random cosmic ray strikes on a camera sensor don't behave this way. They are typically single-point flashes, and it wasn't either of Mars's tiny moons, Phobos, or Deimos, as they move at different velocities and follow predictable trajectory angles. The precise timing and the directional heading of this streak align remarkably well with the expected path of 3i Atlas. Could this actually be the interstellar object flashing through Perseverance's field of view? The image resolution is modest, to be sure, but the scientific implications are tantalizing. This single image, taken from the ground of another world, might be the smoking gun. It exemplifies how authentic discovery unfolds. One puzzling piece of evidence at a time, each one requiring independent confirmation that in this case seems to be deliberately slow walked. Now let's confront the technical challenges that add another layer to this mystery. On October 21st, an event called a superior conjunction occurs. Picture the sun positioned directly between 3i Atlas and Earth, creating a nearly perfect alignment. From our earthly vantage point, we enter a total blind period. Our ground-based telescopes become completely overwhelmed by the sun's brilliance, making any observation impossible. Here's the beautiful irony of modern astronomy. We have the technology to photograph the shadow cast by a supermassive black hole millions of light years away, yet a relatively simple object right in our cosmic backyard can vanish completely when it passes too close to our sun in the sky. This blind spot is exactly why the Martian observation window was so tremendously important. It was the last chance to get a clear look before the object disappeared behind the sun. It's also the perfect time to hide inconvenient data. By the time 3i Atlas reemerges from the sun's glare in December, its properties could be fundamentally changed by the intense heat, making it difficult to verify the strange energy readings and brightness spikes seen earlier. What many overlooked is that this provides the perfect cover for anyone wanting to control the narrative. The mysterious green glow surrounding the object only adds to the puzzle. A visitor under fire. Immediately following the conjunction comes the climactic moment of this entire saga, perihelion. This is the point in an orbit where an object is closest to the sun. For three eye atlas, this nail-biting passage occurs between October 29th and 31st when it will be just 33 million miles from the sun's surface, less than a third of the distance between the Earth and the sun. At this range, the object will be subjected to unimaginable heat and a blast of solar radiation. If 3i Atlas intends to stage a dramatic second act, this is when it will happen. 
Fundamental physics will force any major events to manifest during this passage. Will there be explosive new jets of gas? Will the object's core suffer from structural fragmentation and break apart under the immense gravitational and thermal stress? We could see sudden new surges in brightness that dwarf what we've already witnessed, or it could unexpectedly dim if its surface materials are vaporized. The pulse detected earlier could have been a precursor to a much larger event, a kind of structural realignment before facing the solar inferno. Michio Kaku suggests that if the object has any technological components, this is the moment they might activate to protect it, creating an energy signature unlike anything a natural comet could produce. Looking beyond this trial by fire, the European Space Agency's JUICE spacecraft will initiate an extended monitoring program from deeper within the inner solar system. Its geometric positioning will be excellent for a long-term study as the object heads back out into deep space. However, the waiting period is less than ideal due to operational constraints involving communication and line-of-sight geometry. The frustrating reality is that portions of this crucial data set might not reach public archives until early 2026. Scientific investigation sometimes resembles a slow-motion relay race. One team of scientists passes the baton to the next, often across months or even years, because methodological rigor demands patience. But what if this delay is also by design? It gives authorities plenty of time to analyze the perihelion data in secret and formulate an official explanation for any anomalies. Let's zoom out to the broader picture. Within less than 10 years, humanity has now encountered three confirmed interstellar visitors. Oumuamua arrived first, a bizarre cigar-shaped object that accelerated away from the sun without any visible tail. Then came Borisov, which looked more like a traditional comet. And now we have 3i Atlas, which is displaying its own unique and mystifying behaviors. Each one violates different conventional expectations, forcing us to rewrite our textbooks. The question is no longer if they are coming, but what they are trying to tell us. A new chapter for humanity. At this very instant, 3i Atlas is serving as our unwilling professor. It's demonstrating how frozen interstellar material forged in a completely different star system awakens under intense solar radiation while traveling at extreme velocities. It's revealing how particulate matter and ionized gas can self-organize into complex structures, like its unusual anti-tail that extends sunward. And it's showing us how its gas envelope chemistry can activate almost instantaneously, like flipping a biological switch, to produce that eerie green glow. Are we witnessing the classic swan bands of dicarbon emissions, or have we encountered an imposter phenomenon created through bizarre plasma interactions and photochemical breakdown? The diagonal streak captured by Perseverance offers tantalizing glimpses into the pure forces at play. The brightness progression will ultimately reveal whether the luminosity spike was just a temporary outburst or a sign of sustained intensification as it approached the sun a potential sign of energy regulation. And beneath all this technical analysis lies a quietly profound reality. Our species, essentially microscopic inhabitants of a fragile blue sphere, has constructed a surveillance network orbiting an entirely different world. We built it so that during a few invaluable days, we could monitor a traveler from beyond our stellar borders as it thunders past our cosmic neighborhood. This is a monumental achievement. During Michio Kaku's childhood, comets were often described in folklore as celestial portents and prophetic warnings. Today, he and other scientists recognize them as mobile experimental facilities, delivering pristine samples from other solar systems right to our doorstep. 3i Atlas may never create a spectacular blaze dominating our twilight skies. Yet within the data sets, it generates the spectroscopic signatures, the photographic exposures, the geometric configuration of its plumes, there exists something vastly more permanent than ancient superstition. Genuine, hard-won knowledge. If you seek insight into how scientific progress actually unfolds, observe this investigation carefully. Advancement doesn't emerge from confident press conference declarations, but from tentative graphs filled with meticulous uncertainty measurements. 
Progress doesn't arise from absolute certainty, but from the intellectual bravery to embrace unexpected discoveries and ask uncomfortable questions. Within several weeks, 3i Atlas will re-emerge into our observable sky, fundamentally transformed by its harrowing passage through the solar inferno. We'll conduct fresh measurements and perform comprehensive before and after comparisons. And someday, perhaps sooner than we anticipate, a research paper will begin with these words, we discovered something foundational about interstellar visitors through studying 3i Atlas. That publication will reference the Martian observation campaign, the Perseverance streak, the brightness anomaly, the emerald gas envelope, and the strange pulse that was unofficially detected and officially denied. It will complete another entry in our cosmic encyclopedia, forever changing our place in the universe. The universe owes us no obligation to be simple. Fortunately, it remains obligated to the laws of physics, and it is through those laws that we may finally find the truth. So, was 3i Atlas just a comet, or was its mysterious pulse a deliberate signal from another intelligence? The evidence is out there. What do you believe? Let us know below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more hidden truths.